everyone. Today I have a 30 minute Pilates class for you. So let's go ahead and get started. Find a little Pilates V with your feet and engage your glutes, squeezing your butt. Press the belly button into the spine and we'll come into our Pilates breath. A deep inhale through the nose and an exhale through an open mouth. Inhale, feel the ribs open and exhaling from the back of the throat. One more breath like that. Now inhale to lengthen the spine and exhale to drop the chin to the chest and slowly roll down over the feet. Breathing in at the bottom. And as you exhale, scoop the belly into the spine and slowly unroll yourself to standing, keeping the belly nice and tight. And inhaling up and exhale, rolling down. And breathing in and exhale, scooping the belly and unrolling. And inhale, long spine and exhale, rolling down. And we'll stay dangling over the feet for two breaths. And then walk out into plank. And hold plank. Really concentrate on pressing the belly in towards the spine. And then on your next inhale, bending the knees down to tap the floor. And exhale to straighten the legs. Inhale to bend. And exhale to straighten. Inhale, bend, keeping the belly strong. And exhale, straighten. And again, inhale. And exhale. Now we'll just bend one knee down towards the floor. And then we'll slowly pass the legs as we're switching to bend the other knee down. Inhale, exhale, inhale, exhale, inhale, switch, exhale, tap, inhale, switch, exhale, tap. Is your belly still pressing into the spine? Inhale, exhale, four, three, two, and one. Good, go ahead and straighten the knees and then lift the hips to downward dog. Let's all inhale, lift the heels, and exhale, press the heels down to the mat. And again, inhale, lift, and exhale, lower. And inhale, lift. And exhale, lower the knees down to find yourself on all fours, your hands and your knees. Go ahead and glue the legs together. And reach opposite arm and leg out away from each other. Inhaling to lift the arm and leg up. And then exhaling, elbow to knee. Inhale to open. And exhale, curve the spine to the sky as you reach your elbow to your knee. And inhale, lengthen. And exhale, bend. One more. Inhale. And exhale. Good. Lower everything down and then we'll take a cat cow in between. So inhale, arching the back and lifting the head and chest. And exhale, curving the spine, that same feeling when you're doing elbow to knee. But here you probably have some more distance. Inhale, arching. And exhale, curve. Find that neutral spine again, nice and flat. Gluing the knees back together and move on to the other arm and leg. As you lift your arm and leg, keeping the spine stable and strong. Now exhale, let the spine move up. 
Inhale, reach, find that flat back. And exhale, curve. Inhale, open. And exhale, close. One more. Inhale. And exhale. And hand and knee down. Tuck the toes. And once again, lift the hips. The downward dog. And then walk the feet up to meet the hands. Dangling over the legs. And we'll take about three breaths here. And then lower the hips down to the mat. Find a nice long spine, grabbing in front of the knees. And then exhale, curve the back, and we'll roll all the way to the ground to come into our hundreds. So take the legs to tabletop, or if you'd like to straighten or lower the legs, go ahead, but press that low back down to the floor before we start, and lifting the head and chest. And inhale, two, three, four, five. Exhale, two, three, four, five. Inhale, two, three, four, five. Exhale, two, three, four, five. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale. Exhale. Try to keep the belly pressing down. Exhale. Two, three, four, five. Inhale. Exhale. And the low back down to the ground. Exhale. Two, three, four, five. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale, exhale, good, knees to the chest, and plant the feet, coming into some bent leg roll-ups, inhaling, exhale, press the belly down towards the floor, and slowly peel yourself up, bringing our arms all the way up in line with our ears, inhaling, and exhale, curving our bodies down. One more inhale in here. And exhale, roll up, trying to keep the belly scooping in. Inhale. Lengthen the spine, ears over shoulders, and exhale, roll down. Good, we're gonna stay down and come into single leg stretch. So gather one knee in towards you and lengthen out the other leg. Again, imprinting that spine on the floor. Lift the head and chest and exhale, inhale to switch. Exhale, inhale. Exhale, inhale. Exhale, inhale. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, exhale, inhale, exhale, and rest knees to chest, and again, plant those feet, glue the low back, arms above the ears as you breathe in, and exhale, rolling it up. Find that stacked spine, and exhale, rolling it down. Inhaling in arms above ears. And exhale, rolling it up. Inhale. And exhale. Good, laying ourselves down, and now we'll come into double leg stretch. So both knees into the chest, wrapping the arms and lifting the upper body. Inhale to lengthen arms and legs away, and exhale to bend them back in. Feel the low back pressing down, and as you open everything, don't lose that connection. Exhale, bend. Inhale, open. Exhale, bend. 
inhale, lengthen, and exhale, inhale, and exhale, good, roll it down, and then lengthen out, nice full body stretch, you can let that back arch and ribs open, and then slowly roll over onto your stomach. We'll take our hands, stacked elbows wide, resting our forehead down. Make sure the belly is strong, the sensation of lifting your belly off of the mat. Legs are strong and straight. Inhale to lift the upper body, including the arms. And exhale to lower down. And again, inhale to lift. And exhale to slowly roll down. And inhale, peel it up one inch at a time. And exhale, roll down. Last one, inhale, lift and hold. And open the arms up. Hold. Bring them to the side. Hold and bring them down by your body and lower yourself down. Good, and just rolling back over to our backs. And again, planting the feet, knees to the sky, belly pressing into the floor, inhaling and exhale, rolling up. Good, when we come on up to the top, let the legs stretch out, arms reaching up, flex the feet and inhale there. Exhale into spinal stretch, so belly pressing back behind us, fingertips reaching forward. And we're just gonna unfold ourselves, so think that your fingertips are leading your way back up to that flat back, breathing in. And exhale, fold, curving the spine. And inhale to unroll. And exhale to curve. And inhale to lift. And exhale, fold. Maybe this time fingertips rest all the way to the ground. And then hold for your inhale, and then your exhale, we roll it back to the mat. And we'll come into scissors. So one leg straight to the sky, and the other hovering above the ground, grabbing behind the leg and lifting the head and chest. And we do exhale, inhale to switch. Just one exhale breath today. Inhale to switch, exhale, long breath, inhale, long breath. Exhale, inhale, eight, and seven, six, five. Again, feel that low back pressing towards the floor. Two, one, I might have lost count there, but it's okay. Good, knees into your chest. And reach the arms and legs away from each other. Inhaling. And exhale, rolling ourselves up with straight legs this time. Flex those toes to the sky if they're not already there. And slowly roll up and reach over those feet. And exhale, rolling back. Trying to lay your spine on the floor. Inhaling, arms above the ears. And exhaling, rolling up. Inhale. And exhale, rolling back. Good, and then staying down. Take your legs up 
to the sky. Glue them together. Rest your hands behind the head, elbows open, or you can tuck them under your hips for a little help. And inhale to lower the legs down. And then exhale to lift. Inhale as you lower the legs, low back is imprinted on the floor. And as you exhale to lift, you really press your belly down to lift the legs. Inhale, lowering. And exhale, lifting. And once more, inhale, lower. And exhale to lift. Good, we're gonna come into our twist here. So one leg bent, one leg straight, inhale to lift the chest, and exhale to twist, and slowly roll into the other side, exhale. Inhale, exhale, inhale, exhale. When we try to keep the elbows nice and wide open. Eight, seven, think rib towards your knee. Five, Four, three, two, and one. Knees to the chest, deep breath in, and exhale, full body stretch. Inhale to lengthen, engage those abs, and exhale to roll up. Reaching over the toes. Unroll the spine, feet about mat width or hip width, arms out to a T, coming into saw. So inhale to twist and exhale to open the chest. Inhale, twist and exhale, open. Inhale, twist and exhale, reach. Last one, inhale. Good, and planting those hands behind us and lifting, or planting the feet, lifting the hips. And bending the arms down. Whichever way you want to point your fingers, that feels good to you, that's fine. Good, and then taking one leg to the sky, holding those bent arms, and then pulsing the arms a little bend for four, three, two, and one. And lower the leg and switch. And four, three, two, one, and lower. And switch. And again, bend, two, three, four, lower. And switch. And bend, two, three, four, and lower. And lower everything down, stretching the legs out in front of us. Give those arms a nice circle. And then again, placing the hands back behind us. This time we're gonna lift up with straight legs. So open the legs so you're turned out, knees trying to point away from you. Hands on your shoulders, and then lift the hips as high as you can. And then one leg slowly lifting and lowering. That same leg, lift and lower. And one more, lift and lower. And other side, up and down, up and down, and up and down. It is hard to keep those hips lifted. Good, rolling over into plank and doing leg pull front, finding your plank, and releasing one leg out and lifting that leg and lowering, and lifting, and lowering, and up, and place that foot back down, release the other leg out, and lift, and lower, up, and down, and up, and down. Good, let the knees rest down. Again, give those arms a nice circle, inhaling, and exhale, coming into side plank. 
You can always just keep that knee down to work the top leg or come into a full plank with me. We'll take that top arm to the sky and release that top leg and lift up and down. Inhale to lift and exhale to lower. Inhale, lift and exhale, lower. And one more, inhale and exhale. Good, lower that hand to plank. And just roll over to the other side, opening that arm or lowering the knee down and lift the leg and lower. Inhale, lift, exhale, lower. Inhale and exhale. One more, inhale and exhale. And back to plank and rest the knees down. Good, come back to your first leg and release it back. Make sure we're really tight in the center. Lifting that leg up in line with the rest of your body. And just small pulls, lift it a little higher for eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Then just bend the leg, point your toes to the sky, make sure the knee's down. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Straighten back the leg and flex the feet so toes point towards the floor and lift. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. And bend the leg, bottom of the foot to the sky. Eight, seven, six, keep the center of your body strong. Four, three, two, and one. Good, lower it down. And stretching out your other side, Lifting. Also try to keep the head in line with the back and we lift for eight, seven, six, knee pointing down to the floor, four, three, two, one, bending the leg, toes to the sky, eight, seven, six, five. Try to isolate that leg movement, not letting it affect any other part of your body. Stretching the leg out and flexing the foot and lifting, eight, seven, six, feel the back of the knee stretching, five, four, three, two, one, and bend, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, and lower. Good, come back into plank. And another set of leg pulls. So lift your first leg up. This time we'll keep the toes pointing towards the floor and we're just gonna rock our shoulders back and then where they were. And again, back and front, back and front and back and front and lower. And other side, we'll lift the back of the heel. Back and front, three, two, and one. Lower down, back to our first leg. And now we just go three, two, and one. And lower and switch. Three, two, one. <clears throat> lower, switch, two, one. And switch, two, and one. And switch and just lift, rock back and front and lower, lift, back, front, lower, and lower everything with as much control as you can to the floor. And again, resting our forehead in our hands, you can widen the legs, elbows are wide, belly is strong, and lifting both legs off the floor and lowering down, and lift, and lower, up and down. Keep your center tight and lift and lower. Four and down. Three and down. Two and down. And one and down. Go 
good. Come on onto your side and press yourself onto your elbow. So we're in a little clamshell feet lined up with hips. So we're gonna lift ourselves up as we open the knee and we're gonna keep extending, opening the arm and leg and lowering everything down. And lift and open the legs and extend and lower it down. And lift and open and lower. And lift and open and we'll hold it there. And lifting that top leg for eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, and slowly lower everything down. And one more time, lifting, opening the knees, extending the arm and leg, and lift higher for eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Good, press yourself up. Take the legs to the other side. Lowering down to your elbow. And we lift the hips. So feet, hips, shoulder, keep them in line. And lift and open and extend and lower everything with control. So belly pressing into the spine here. Lift open and extend. And lower and lift and extend and lower and another thing we're doing is try to keep that top hip from twisting back try to keep it stacked right on top of your bottom hip good this time lift and we'll hold and lift for eight seven six five four one and down. One more time and lift. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, and down. Good. Extend the legs and one more time onto our stomachs, reaching the arms out away from us and coming into some slow swimmers. So lifting everything up off the mat with your tight belly. Extended legs and opposite arm and leg lift and switch. Three, four, take nice and long deep breaths. Seven, eight, eight more. Nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, and rest it down. Hands on your shoulders. We're just making our way to child's pose, so maybe just lift the hips, press them back, or maybe press your plank. Press those hips back, arms extended in front of us. Take three nice deep breaths. And go ahead and find downward facing dog. And then walk the feet up to meet the hands. And then we'll widen the legs wherever feels comfortable for you. Toes are pointing straight in front of us. Let the body hang down. Maybe grab the elbows. Let the body dangle. And then let your hands walk over to one foot. Give yourself a gentle pull towards that leg. Keep your breath going. And go ahead and switch to the other leg. And then back towards the center. And then heel toe those feet together. Or they can be hip width if that feels better for you. And take a nice deep breath in. And your exhale, you scoop the belly in and we slowly unroll our 
ourselves to standing. Inhale to lift the arms. Exhale, arms open by the sides and we roll down one last time. Inhaling and exhale, engage those low abs as you roll up. And inhale the arms and exhale to finish our 30 minute Pilates class today. Okay, thank you. Hope you had a good short workout. Have